I'm Adam Cranfill with Cal OES. Here in the Central Valley, residents have been heavily impacted by recent spring storms. Cal OES is working around the clock to ensure residents have access to the resources they need as we continue on the road to recovery. As California prepares for snowmelt from a record deep snowpack in the southern Sierra Nevadas, protecting community lifelines is critical to ensure residents have access to resources like food, water, and medical care. The California Governor's Office of Emergency Services, Cal OES, is coordinating with local officials and Cal Fire to raise the grade of Avenue 56 in Tulare County about six to eight feet. This follows its complete submergence from atmospheric river inundations. The communities of Alpaw and Allensworth heavily rely on this route for daily commutes, as well as an evacuation route should flood waters rise. Behind us here, we actually had a big, uh, you know, overpass from the high-speed rail. And what we're doing is we have scrapers and, you know, loaders and big pieces of equipment. And we've, we've came in and we're actually use, utilizing this equipment to build the road up. Prior to the Avenue 56 project, Cal OES coordinated with Tulare County to deploy Cal Fire Incident Management Team 5 to aid in flood fighting efforts. Their response? Super sacks. Super sacks are bags filled with about 2,500 pounds of rock, sand, and gravel. These sacks are a very effective method to quickly patch breached areas of levees and rivers. When you're patching these levee systems, you patch one place, but you start putting pressure on other weak spots. So by having, um, we had a lot of super sacks built and staged, and when we went after these levee breaches, we made sure that we had enough material on the ground that we could take care of that and have backup in case we had another breach. As Tulare, Kings, Kern, and Fresno County area residents work to recover from the impacts of recent spring storms, Cal OES is there every step of the way, coordinating with local, state, and federal agencies to aid Californians in recovery efforts. The amount of water coming into the system greatly exceeded any expectations and no one agency was going to be able to handle all of that. We couldn't, so the county couldn't handle it by themselves and uh, so they requested an incident management team which Cal OES has been coordinating with to get resources down here in order to prevent additional issues. Cal OES continues to coordinate with local and state partners to provide daily updates to residents with flood information message boards within their communities, as well as provide readily available sandbags and other flood preparedness resources. As part of the Presidential Major Disaster Declaration, residents and business owners in Kern, Mariposa, Monterey, San Benito, San Bernardino, Santa Cruz, Tulare, and Tuolumne counties who sustained losses can apply for disaster assistance. To learn how to apply for disaster assistance and see more from us, visit our website news.caloes.ca.gov and follow us on all our social media platforms.